So today, uh, I'm going to do a video on how to sterilize uh, bottles with Philips Avent uh, sterilizer. Uh, so first, uh, you have uh, these uh, sterilizer comes in three parts. This is the bottom part. Then you have like two uh, compartments here. One for the bottle, bottle alone, and the second one is for the nipples and uh, the covering and the lid part i'm sorry for the bad lighting uh, i suddenly decided to do this at night and so uh, i didn't have a good another time this is the free time that i've got so let's get started so these are the three parts I just got a plug here uh, and so this is the place where we will pour water they say 20 ml of sterile water i just put that 20 ml of tap water uh, so yeah let's get started so I've taken 20 ml of tap water here I'm just going to pour it inside you don't you, you don't have to measure like correct 20 ml just pour until it is almost full you can see it and once you've poured the water you just put in all the bottles so I've washed uh, uh, with soap water all my bottles. So here you can see I'm using all the different types of bottles here. This is Avent, uh, this is Chico, this is another type of Chico bottle and this is a small one. So uh, people uh, generally have a uh, um, confusion that you can only sterilize Avent bottles in Avent. Uh, I think there is only a slight height difference in this bottle but you can properly sterilize it and <laughs> I usually sterilize the munchkin sippy cups also actually only the uh, straw parts I sterilize not the inflated cup so once uh, you have washed and uh, washed all your bottles with soapy water and cleaned it and you can allow it to drain for a little bit and then uh, you just pour the water on, uh, in the sterilizer and now we will just load the sterilizer so here uh, I'm going to load the top compartment first because I just sorted all the nipples and the covering and everything because I've got different types of uh, bottles here I'm going to keep it accordingly so these are the event nipples and uh, the covers also are different lids are also different um, so okay let's load them so first you place the nipple and then you put the lid over it and then the cap and the cap should be placed on this slot here given here it is actually recommended for six bottles but you i usually load up to one two three four five six seven bottles that's fine uh, so let's load all these so here as you can see i've loaded like one two three four five six seven bottles here uh, you don't get like the proper uh, this is actually the area for the lid uh, you won't get uh, if you load accordingly you won't get the proper space <laughs> yes kevin uh, so this is the loaded top compartment so once you have loaded the top compartment you can close it with this lid and always take care once you open you should keep the lid like this so yeah this, uh, the top part is loaded now uh, the bottom compartment you just um, load the bottles so you, as all you all of you know you just load it like upside down like this so in this i have loaded all the bottles all the seven bottles plus uh, my parts of the sippy cups uh, and the straws so, uh, uh, so now uh, the process is over uh, uh, the one thing i shot i think uh, i thought i was shooting it but uh, it, uh, it was not recorded i'm so sorry so, just... so you just uh, mount the two parts uh, like this place it over uh, and then switch on and put on the switch on the main button a red light will come and now actually uh, the process is over i thought i just shot it and actually it was not recorded i'm so sorry there's nothing it's just uh, you place the uh, two compartments and then push this blue button there will be a red light there and it'll get, go off automatically once the process is over and i forgot to mention about uh this is so hot now about the tongs here this is actually for like uh, taking uh, the nipple like this and uh, 
just uh, pull it out like that i'm sorry i'm holding a camera with one hand so i can't do it so this is the thing i forgot to tell you and uh, that's it it's so simple if you want a review on this phillips event the pros and cons please leave a comment below and i'll do the video thank you